Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of Tram Simulator Urban Transit. Back in Angel Shores today where we are in our tram, uh, driving our new route that we created in the last episode. We've, uh, it actually remembered exactly where we were, which is quite a refreshing change. Uh, it doesn't remember on Bus Simulator 21, whereas on this it appears it remembers exactly where you were and it remembers all the missions as well. So uh, if we just bob the doors open there, there we go, you'll see it remembers that we've done the 40 passengers, uh, 14 sorry, out of 40. So we're going to uh, we're going to continue on our mission. Uh, so I think we've only done the first we've only done the first route, haven't we? So uh, yeah, there we go. We'll, we'll carry on with this full steam ahead with the tram. So we're just driving around this area really, aren't we, uh, at peak time? Obviously people have to get off the tram, we'll, uh, we'll stop doing that right. So we can go right on red, but I have a feeling that this chap's going to get in our way in this uh, in this 4x4. Oh no, look at that, that's uh, good timing. We've had some really, really good... Oh, what, what, what are you doing here? Come on. What's going on? I can't actually see, see what's going on there. Right, full steam ahead. Off we go. Where are we going next? West 3rd Street. I don't know where that is. No idea where that is. But uh, I'm sure... Is it round... It's round here somewhere, isn't it? Oh, hang on. Let's just make sure we don't run a member of the public over. That's never going to go down well, is it? Right, round we go. Full steam ahead. Wow, look at that. How you can, uh, you can get some right speed down here. And it seems to think that this is fine. In the bottom left-hand corner, it didn't say we were speeding. I mean, hell, it's a, uh, an efficient tram, isn't it? Right, it appears West 3rd Street is all the way around this corner. See, it's annoying because if I made the route, uh, I would have it so that it stopped at all these places. I think that would make more sense than a tram that didn't. But uh, but hey-ho, we'll, uh, we'll do as the game says. It's a good job you can't derail on this thing, isn't it? Look at that. We'll, uh, we'll have a... Have a nice little... Ooh, look at that. Right, we, uh, we'll nip back in here so that we can stop. Right, we're going left here. Not here, but at this junction. Right, round we go to West 3rd Street. Oh, here we go. Right, we'll have a bit of braking. The tomato plants on my windowsill aren't looking so good. Heck. Maybe I should ask my grandfather about it. There we go. There right, everybody on. Time. Everybody on. Heck, it's going to be a payday at this rate. I wonder at what point we'll unlock the new trams. Because I would quite like a different type of tram to drive. I mean, this tram is absolutely fine. I like this tram. It's uh, it's not a particularly good looking thing. It sort of reminds me of the Dusseldorf trams. A little bit. But uh, the other tram alternative is the old tram, which is a bit more of a heritage tram, isn't it? So it sort of feels a bit weird driving a heritage tram around the city. I think something DDA compliant is uh, is always, you know, it's what you want, isn't it, on a tram? Seriously. I mean, these are faster, they're, you know, they're right nippy little numbers, aren't they? But, uh, yeah, I would quite like that. There is another modern tram that you can unlock. It, I don't think it looks particularly nice. I think it's a right ugly thing. Oh, look, speaking of old tram, there it is, look. On our, uh, on our old route that we spent ages on our horrible, horrible route to. Oh, no. I left my ticket in my other pants. Oh dear. It's a good job there's no ticket check today, isn't it? Right, there we go. I, my train. I, I mean, sorry? I crashed into an obstacle. I think you'll find that has just driven through me. That's uh, it's not very kind, is it? What are we on? 24 out of 40. I can't believe the tram has just driven through me. I mean, is that sort of... Is, is that okay? Is that, is that what we do? Are they all going to do that? That'll be really annoying. I mean, that is... There's not actually that many bugs on this I've discovered in terms of, uh, you know, compared to Bus Simulator 21. I still think that tram looks very odd in front, given that they've not bothered to put any wires up. That just really confuses me. Come on. Off you go. You appear to be stuck. I mean, you're not parked at red lights, are you? I mean, what what do I do? Do I just nudge this person? The the tram is broken. There we go. So you can you can nudge them and they despawn. What's going on? I mean, do we do we just? There we go. Around the corner. Come on, move out my way. 
Oh, he's off. That sort of, you know, accelerates like the uh, the buses off Simpsons Road Rage. And a lot of you aren't going to be old enough to remember Simpsons Road Rage. But yeah, they used to career around town crashing into things. The yellow buses. Come on, some of you must know what I'm on about. Please no, tell me I'm not the only one that knows what Simpsons Road Rage is. Road Rage. Road Rage. That's the one. It was a, a very therapeutic game for me, actually, as it happens. There we go. Right, door's shut. And away we go. Playing Hold on tight, everybody. Is somehow relaxing and stressful at the same time. Right, off we go. Round to the... Uh, oh, hang on. That is very much a red light. Sorry about that. I wonder if we'll... Uh, yeah, I will let you get off at the next stop, sir. Jump to red light. Oh, it does actually fine you for that now. I'm pretty sure it didn't use to. Right, here we go. There we go. Stop! Doors are opening. There we go, and we're going to get the point for letting him off. Look at that. Come on, everyone off. That's a fair few, isn't it? Look at that. How many have we got now? 36 out of 40. Lovely. So, hopefully, we should have... I mean, I can't see how many passengers we've got on. We must have at least four, mustn't we? Yeah, we've easily got four there. That is champion. Right, round to the left. Oh, and that's the last stop as well. Please leave the tram. We've done a full circuit of the route there. Lovely. Right, round to the left. And, oh, it's all the way around the corner. Again, I, I keep thinking that it's like the next stop like this one. It's really annoying. It'd be nice to just be able to, you know, I, I don't really get this sort of a stop has a peak time in the morning and an afternoon. It's a nice little, I get what they're trying to sort of do, but I just find it odd that's not how trams and buses work in real life. You know, that one stop will only be busy in the morning. It, you know, stops vary through the day. You know, the, 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 the route balancing, that just confuses the heck out of me. I've got no idea what it means by any of that. Um... But yeah, you know, like on things like City Bus Manager, we don't have any route balancing, do we? Or peak times at bus stops. It's just busier areas that have busier trams. Right, there we go. So, everyone's going to get off this now. We can bin this tram. Well, I said we can bin it. Oh, that's just like the last video. Right, off you pop. Has that, has that got someone in it? Right, so, oh, there we go. We've got one of our employees. So, now we need to create a morning slash evening peak line that connects Pecunia, Auris Harbour, Millbrook, Baytree, Greenwood, and transport 40 passengers at peak time. Right, so, uh, Baytree or Greenwood. R oh, no. Right, hang on. To level three. Well, obviously, it would make sense to do Greenwood again, wouldn't it? Lakeside View or Highlander Park to level three. Uh, right, hang on. Oh, we're going to have to go around here, right? We will need a new tram route for that. So, right, where are we? Create a new route. No? Q? Create route? No? How about now? There we go. Right, tram route 5. So where are we going? Uh, we're going to go for a morning route again, I think. So Pecunia is up here. What, what route is this? I mean, that's a daytime route, isn't it? That's a sunrise. That's a night time. So we want... But there are no stops like that in Pecunia. There are only daytime stops. Ooh, that's not good. Right, hang on. So we'll have to stop there. Auris Harbour as a morning. Yeah, Millbrook as a daytime. Ooh, this is going to be difficult. Peak time. So that's during the day. Right, we've got Millbrook on board. Bay Tree. Morning again. Greenwood. Morning. Hang on, which, which one's that? That's Copper Pot. Yeah. And transport 40 passengers at peak time. So we're going to go back up here. Yeah, that's lovely. Through there. We'll go round there. I mean, this is still going to be a peak time morning route, isn't it? There we go. Valley Spring. That'll do. That is absolutely fine. 
Oh, hang on a second, that's not good. Right, so we may as well just sort of go around there, hadn't we? Oh, hang on. Right, if we take number 1 off, number 10, number 11, that can then go back around there. Okay, so 11 then goes... Yeah, right, I see. Because that is in Pecunia. Right, so if I do that... So, the routes are all well planned out, and now it's time to put them into action. I need you to allocate enough trams to these routes, and even take a few shifts yourself. Hmm. I want to experience firsthand whether these routes are delivering the benefits we expect. And, if demand is as I assess it to be, we might want to consider using those new, long trams we have coming in. Right, okay, well, I mean, the demand is there already, sir. What we shall see is if we've got... Oh, right, we can use these times two. S4D2, which looks completely different to the S4D2 times two. No, I want to use this one. I want to use that one. Yeah. No, well, tell you what we'll do. We'll buy this. This is new. Now, this will be interesting. What we'll do is we'll go with this dual tram. There we go. Right, full time. Not that one. STG. Let's use the times two. Oh, it seems to think it'll be enough. Right. So, off we go. I'm intrigued to see if these two trams are stuck together. And whether the bogies are coupled. They are. Look at that. They are, you know. Wow. These guys are actually doing pretty well at this. This tram business. I think they'd have been much better if they'd have just made a tram simulator from the off and not bothered with the bus simulator. Maybe. They seem to get, like, sort of, look, it's on the wheels. I mean, the fact that this is a totally different type of tram to before. I mean, the sound's pretty decent. I mean, it's quite a yomp, isn't it? Valley Spring High School. That is quite... Oi! What on earth is that? I mean, it's a while since we've... Uh, I mean, the sounds are exactly the same. The cab is exactly the same. Although now, instead of just Cam 1, we have Cam 1 and Cam 2. Right, round we go. I don't know what those are meant to be showing, you know. Yeah, absolutely no idea, to tell you the truth, what is meant to be displayed at Cam 1 and Cam 2. Straight through. Look at that. Traffic lights working well for us. Right, so we're meant to be going not left here, but straight on, I think. There we go. Straight on. Oh, we've just managed to get through the lights before they changed. Isn't that good? They've been working well for us, haven't they, today? And recently, you know, the traffic lights on this game, maybe it's because I've been so mean about this game, they thought, do you know what, we're going to be nice to him and, uh, and get him some good traffic lights. Just to, just to sort of cheer the miserable bugger up. Come on, slow down. Whee! Oh, we've been here before, haven't we? The Valley Spring High School. Stop! Are they all opening the doors on this? Yes, they appear to be. That's good. I do quite like it's like two separate trams. It's very Tatra, isn't it? I'm hoping that with us being sort of a bendy tram, we might uh, we might be quite busy. It'll get this done fairly quickly. You know, like the upgrades on uh, on those routes when we were trying to upgrade the area and we were using the bendy tram, the uh, bendy buses. Sorry. Round we go again. Come on, stop! We're gonna. Uh, oh yeah, I'll tell you what, we'll have a have a photo of that. I do quite like this. You know, it's a decent looking tram. Off we go. Right, where are we going? Straight up here. Oh, hang on, there's going to be someone getting in the way here. Come on. It's a shame it uses the same ding, 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 ding as uh, as the, you know, the other tram. If 
passengers listening to really loud music. Yeah, but they're probably in the rear set. If there's, if there's two separate sets, how on earth is the driver expected to... Yeah, there's nobody in the front set bopping away. Are they in the back set? I don't know, I can't see. There's a tram stop ready for an upgrade there. That's exciting, isn't it? Hopefully we'll accidentally manage to upgrade the, uh, the, the areas that it's saying we need to upgrade. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Happy accident. And by uh, by having this stop here instead, we've managed to shave off uh, the uh, the extra bit that we'd have to drive around the back. Go on, stop. Are we actually managing? Eight out of oh, look, eight out of forty. We're doing it. We are doing it right. Everybody off. That is quite a number. So that's on 17 out of 40. So we're going to carry on round. Where are we going? We've got no instructions as to where to go. Oh, right. So we're going round to the right here. Have a few more points. Seems a bit weird that. Uh, oh yeah, they've not built the line down there. That's a, that's why, isn't it? I mean, I'm going to be one of those drivers that's now parked over the crossing, so nobody can cross the road. Yeah, come on, off we go. I do like the fact you can bully the cars out of the way by flashing your lights at them. They tend to move. Goodness me, right, if I do that, he'll despawn. There we go. Right, we're on the move again. It's always good for a traffic jam on this game. Just sort of gently nudge them. Gently nudge them up the jacks in uh, and they despawn. If only that worked in real life traffic. Don't think I'd want to dent my car. Might work in the bus though, you know. Right, so we're driving all the way to Dock 1. We are actually running late. This tram is not cut out for speed, is it? Not cut out for speed at all. You'd think passenger loading times would be better. I'm sorry, we're going to run this light because we are a tram. And that means we're important. We can cope with the fine, and that's going to yell at me probably for driving too fast. Oh no, it didn't yell at me for, uh, for skipping the light. Uh, it makes a change. Alright, down we go. Let's see. Oh, hang on, we're speeding. Let's have a bit of braking. It's a right little town runner this, isn't it? Right, stop number one. Come on, let's have some people on. Just one. You're joking. No, we need more than one. Excellent. Right, well, we've got one bloke question about the route was ignored. Oh yeah, because uh, it was coming to the, the top to ask us. And we just ignored it and set off. Don't worry, I'm, I'm sure whatever you were going to ask. It's fine. It's absolutely fine. Right, off we go. So we're going round to the left here. Bit of a break, little bit of breaking. The garbage, of course. Round we go. Come on, keep up with it. There we go. Right, off we go again. This tram's so slow. <laughs> so slow. I noticed how it gave us the old knacker tram first of all. It didn't give us the nippy tram, did it? The longer version. That's oh yeah, you'll unlock that later. I wonder what's special about that new tram then. There must be something, you know, something good about it, so that we use that one instead of, you know, to make it worth unlocking. Alright, round we go. Up 
we go, and then round to the left again. That is quite a fast corner. And luckily, oh, there's another tram there. Oh, that's on the route too. That's on that horrendously long route. I see. I can't believe we've got one bloke on. Oh no! Oops. Yeah, that that I did try to stop that time. Oh well, never mind. We tried our best. And do you know what? So long as you tried, people can't yell at you for that. Up we go. There's a hell of a, uh, a hell of a gap between stops, isn't there? Right, round to the left at the top. Lovely. Bit of braking. Round we go. Millbrook Square South. Oh, so that's round to the left again up here. And, uh, oh, it's just there. I can see it hoving into view on the minimap. Right, round we go. It's a good job we've got this double tram on to fit more people on, isn't it? Right, so we're going round to the left here. Uh, round to the right, sorry. No, not the left, otherwise we'll have to go all the way round again. Round we go. Ah, uh, I can't find my keys. Ah, right, there we go. Stop, stop, stop! Um, excuse me? You're blocking the door. Oh, you're joking. Come on, love. What are you doing? I want to see your ticket. The has such a great this month. Oh, there you go. You see, if you hadn't have done that, maybe he was trying to signal to me that she was a fair dodger. There we go. I mean, it's one of those, isn't it? Looking at this tram, anybody could, could you know, just sort of tech over the tram while I'm busy down there. That could have been a ruse, that person blocking the door. So I'd go down to tell them off. And then, you know, someone else, another member of their party, just nick me tram. Could you imagine? You could see it happening, couldn't you? Crime rates of Angel Shaw's, good lord. It's just one more work day, and I'm off. Oh, that's, yeah, that's a bit fast around there. It's a bit of an odd route. Oh, hang on. Faster, slower, faster, slower. Make your mind up. Every time you go around a corner, it slows you down, even if you're doing 30 mile an hour. I wonder if you can crash into the trees down this line. It wouldn't make, uh, it wouldn't make me too surprised. There we go. Doors are opening. Come on, everybody. Hi. Hello. Everybody on, everybody off. I was going to say we must be getting close. I did not skip a stop. Oh, is that because I set off without indicating? But I didn't turn. I carried on in a straight line. Right, so, oh no, hang on. Straight on here. And then left at the next one. Oh, passengers have fallen asleep. Good heavens. We'll have to wake them up, won't we? Are they in this set? If they're in the other set, then uh, then unfortunately they won't be getting woken up, will they? I'm intrigued. Oh, it's the pedals, isn't it? It's the pedals. Oh, hang on. Oh, that's a... What do I do now? Ah. What happens now? I mean, we, we can't reverse, can we? Do, we? do we do that? Reset the vehicle. Aha! To the street. But we can't go backwards. Reset. Aha! Right, off we go again. Right, keep going. We'll, we'll have to actually go to the right this time. So it just moves you a little bit further backwards, doesn't it? 
Oh, get out of the way! I thought we could go right on red. We could go right on red, that's fine. Oh, hang on, slow down. There we go. Since when can we not go right on red anymore? <laughs> I mean, I've jumped another couple of red lights today, so maybe it was one of the old finds catching up with me. But yeah, I, I thought we could still go right on red in the tram. We've done it many a times and it hasn't yelled at me. Right, full steam ahead, up to 6th Street. There we go, right. Hey, slow down, slow down, slow down. There we go, right, everybody on. On you get, right, okay, so 22. Ooh, look at that. Nice three star rating there. At Greenwood. This is quite a good one. Have we got many stops in Greenwood? I can't remember. I don't think we do. This is a hell of a challenge, isn't it? There's, uh, there's still quite a lot to do. I do like this. It's uh, it's a good few challenges for us. You know, it's not the... Uh, I did find with Bus Simulator 21, it's very easy to sort of get into the habit of doing the same thing again and again. And I think that's what that game sort of was. It's the same sort of upgrade this, upgrade that. Whereas this is actually deliver a certain amount of passengers. It's, uh, it's good. All right, challenge, and uh, I find myself really enjoying this. I'm uh, I'm actually interested in what we're doing. I'm not just playing it for you guys. I find that with Bus Simulator 21, I can often sort of looking back at some of the challenges, feel a little bit like, mm, right, this again, same old, same old. Whereas no, even though I know that this is much of the same, the the challenges are pretty good. The storyline's all right. You know, it's it's not the worst, is it? I mean, I still don't believe that it's anything like driving a real tram. I don't believe that, I mean, we're not stopping for one. A real tram could stop on a ten pence piece if they if they got the magnets out. You know, it just could. So I think the physics are a little bit lacklustre, but at the same time, as a game, yeah, it's alright. Stop! Another stop ready for an upgrade. Right, let's uh, let's do that. Twenty-five out of forty. Right, come on. We can get to the next stop, can't we? Don't know where that is. Baytree Church. Oh, it's in Baytree. Right, okay. Of which case, yes, we definitely can. Let's uh, full steam ahead down here. My fast driving means we apparently seem to have caught up our time. Right, stop, stop, stop. Goodbye. Plenty on, plenty off as usual. Off we go. Come on, up the hill. I beg your pardon, beeping at me. I don't know. Who do they think they are? Scandalous. Absolutely scandalous. Right, well, that is where we're going to leave it for today. I do hope you have enjoyed our trip to uh, Angel Shores today. If you have, please do click the like button. It's always appreciated. But, uh, I say that every video, but that's because I genuinely really do appreciate you guys showing up here every day. It, uh, it means a lot. Uh, do let me know what you think in the comments. And, uh, yeah, do make sure, if you haven't already, that you do subscribe so that you never miss out on any of this absolutely riveting tram simulator urban transit action. Other than that, as I say, thank you so, so much for watching. And uh, hope... Hopefully, I shall see you all next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.